Hi and welcome students. Today's tutorial will cover PowerPoint 2016 and I'm going to teach you how to insert a video onto your PowerPoint presentations. Let's go ahead and begin. So you'll see that I have a presentation here that deals with people trying to visit the Arboretum. And so I'm going to go to slide 2 where I have an open area to insert the video. You'll see here that I have a content placeholder. I'm going to show you two different ways to insert videos onto your presentations and the first of which we deal with the content placeholder. So sometimes you'll see that it has a placeholder and you'll see these six options down here. You could choose the bottom right option, which is insert video, to insert a video onto your presentation. So if you click right there, it's going to open up this page right here. Now you'll see that you could choose either from a file, from your OneDrive, from YouTube, or an embed code. Well, on this example, I'm going to show you how to insert it from a file. So I could click right here on Browse. Now from the file, I'm going to show you right here, I'm looking at my desktop where I've saved the file, and I'm going to insert this video right here of the uh, flowers. Now take note that it's a .wmv file which is a Windows uh, media video file and so if I click there and I click insert it's going to insert that file in. Keep in mind that only some types of uh, videos are supported but mp4 and WMV are and so you shouldn't really have a problem as long as you're looking uh, at really an mp4 file. So uh, any of these video files should work. So you can take a look at that list right there. All right, so you'll see all of the available files right there and then you click insert. Now keep in mind as you hover over it in here, you'll see the size of the file as well as the length. I'm only inserting in a 20 second video. The reasoning for that is because it'll actually take less time to actually insert into my presentation. Once I put it onto the presentation, I have some options of what I could do as far as the format and the playback, but I'm gonna go over that in just a little. So right here, as I hit play, you could see down here, the video actually begins. And so that's how you insert a video on a content placeholder. Notice that it took up the exact space that was in the content placeholder and it did not start playing until I actually hit play pause right down there. So I'll go ahead and delete that now and I'm going to show you the other way to insert in a video onto your presentation. So this is a blank slide here. I'm going to go to the insert tab this time. And then on the far right side, you'll see this group right over here, media. This is where you can insert audio files or video files. I'm going to choose a video file. And then I'm going to choose either an online video. This is where you can get videos from like YouTube and things like that. Or you can uh, insert it again from your PC. So I already have the video saved. I find the video right there. I click insert and notice this time it inserts it in its uh, natural height and width, not uh, set to the content placeholder. So now I have this video here. Now what can we actually do with the video? Well on this option here I'm actually going to uh, go ahead and increase the height of the video and so you can do that in the uh, video tools format tab. You're only going to see this tab if you have the video clicked. For instance if I click away I'll click out here you'll notice that those tabs are no longer available. Again to format the video it's just like a picture you have to click on it first. All right, so I've got the pic or I've got the video in right there. All right, so first thing I'm going to do is change the size of the video. That's in the Video Tools Format tab, the size group, and I'm going to change this change the size right here to 6.25, 6.25, and I press Enter. Notice that the width was adjusted automatically with the slide, or sorry, with the video. Now. Also notice that it extended from the bottom right, so now a bit of the video actually goes off the page, which is no good. I could fix that by going right here to the Arrange group, and then I can use the Arrange groups to align the video on the page. So right here I'm going to click on that, and it's going to align to the slide. So I'm going to align to the bottom of the slide, which will again move the video up just a little bit so that the bottom of the video displays at the very bottom of the slide. And then I'm going to hit Align one more time. And this time I'm going to choose Align Center, which will move it to the center of the slide. So that puts it exactly at the bottom center of the slide. So that's an easy way to align your videos. Keep in mind that also works with pictures and shapes as well. All right, next I'm going to change the shape of the video. A lot of times these hard edges don't look good on a video, so I'm actually going to change the video style right here. So I'll go ahead and click the More button, and you can see a variety of styles to choose from. All right, I'm going to find this one right down here, bevel rectangle. That one looks nice. I click it. Now notice the player. It will cut off a portion of the video in the top left and right, but there's usually not much going on in that video or in that uh, portion of the video. 
All right, so the next thing I'm going to do is in the playback area. So again, that's a little bit about formatting your videos. Now I'm going to go to the playback group. All right, so I click on the playback tab, and then I see that I have some options like play, and if I click that, it just plays the video. That looks good. Uh, I have bookmarks, and then I have this group right here called editing. I could actually go in here and I could trim the video down. So let's go ahead and click trim video and you'll see that I have options to trim the video. The start time is right there, so if I wanted to trim off a bit of the video at the beginning, trim meaning remove that portion of the video, this is useful especially on longer videos. Let's say you take a YouTube video that's five minutes long and you just want 30 seconds of that video, you would just trim that 30 seconds. So right here I'm gonna leave the front end of the video okay, but let's say I just want it to play for 14 seconds, I could actually either click and drag this red bar down to 14 right here, or I could actually just do 00, zero uh, and you can see the value right there, dot fourteen dot zero zero zero, and you'll see that'll give me perfectly at 14 seconds uh, for the video length, and then I could click OK. All right, so there we go. Now the video has been trimmed just to 14 seconds, so after the 14 seconds, it'll stop playing. Keep in mind, you do have options like to start the video automatically, Okay, so you can click right there and the video will now start automatically on the slide and you could also loop the video until stopped. So you have a lot of different options right here in the video options area and you can actually add in your captions there as well. So there's a lot of options in the playback area and a lot of options for formatting your video. So hopefully uh, this tutorial has taught you about the two different ways to insert the video as well as how to format and change the playback options. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Please give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. Uh, if you have any questions, please put it in the comment section and please consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you so much for watching and have a great rest of your day.